Welcome to Düsseldorf. Welcome to the W3C Web of Things Interest Group face-to-face -face meeting, this time hosted by W3C member Lemonbeat. Launched in 2015, the Interest Group provides a forum for technical discussions to identify use cases for a combination of the Internet of Things with the so-called Web of Data. During practical demo setups, the Plugfest, and theoretical discussions, the group aims to find a way to take the complexity out of the Internet of Things. Magic. So let's hear what some of the participants have to say about the IoT, its challenges and possible solutions. So I think uh, the number one challenge is complexity. That there's uh, you know so much going on and so many different kinds of standards and interoperability is a big problem. That's definitely one problem. The second big problem is security. Mm -hmm. So we really need to tackle the security and privacy problems head on uh, in, in a principal way. And I think the biggest problem with security is actually getting people to agree and to take it seriously, right? The uh, so W3C, we're trying to see if we can build bridges across all of the different other standard organizations and technologies so that uh, application developers can write applications simply to have them work with all the different IT technologies that are there. Well, as our mission kind of states, it's this fragmentation, these data silos we see in the IoT today. So IoT, yeah, solve the connectivity so we can connect devices, but but we cannot really build the applications because they all end up in their own ecosystem. And with the Web of Things, we exactly want to address this, this challenge to, to build what kind of the web did for, for the normal internet. We want to do with the Web of Things for the Internet of Things to have this horizontal, nice integrating application layer. There's really few standardization, so we need manufacturer neutral solutions, we need standard inf interfaces, we need standard protocols, and we need a fair pricing out of this and in, in using standards you can achieve that. Most of these alliances are focusing on some particular domains or te technologies like the OCF is uh, uh, 1M2M for example both focused on smart homes to start with although they're kind of broadening out from there. Whereas WGC we want to be able to span all of the application areas so it's, it's a little bit of a, a, a challenge but we think we can do it. Looking back a year I think we spent most time on actually creating a common understanding so um, because it's so diverse different application domains there are a lot of people with different backgrounds well I really want to accomplish having you know uh, at least a draft released end of this year I'm hoping and you know the, the charter says we have it in two years you have to release a recommendation so we really gotta get a draft done this year and all I do is I want to see happen to get a draft done this year spend all of next year hammering on it and doing implementations and refining it. W3C is that it's a group of people which are really focused. They have one vision and it's a global group which is focusing on, on standardization and that's exactly what we urgently need.